Fedora or Pop OS. Picking the perfect Linux desktop can feel overwhelming. In today's video, we'll put these two powerhouses head to head, comparing their interfaces, software ecosystems, performance, and stability, so you can decide which distro deserves a spot on your rig. User Interface and Desktop Experience Let's start with the look and feel. Pop! OS features a polished GNOME desktop enhanced by System76's Pop! Shell tiling extension. Windows snap neatly into place, workspaces are easy to navigate with keyboard shortcuts, and the minimal dock keeps your favorite apps front and center. On the other side, Fedora Workstation ships the latest vanilla GNOME, complete with Wayland support out of the box. You'll notice fluid animations, crisp font rendering, and seamless monitor hot plugging. Because Fedora adopts upstream GNOME immediately, you're always running the current design vision from the GNOME project. Software and Package Management Next up, Software Availability. Pop! OS offers the Pop Shop, a curated app store with essential tools like the Pop! OS installer and firmware flasher pre-configured. Flatpak support is built in, making it simple to install sandboxed apps. Fedora's strength lies in its vast RPM repositories and the Fedora project's commitment to open source. You get bleeding-edge versions of GNOME, Firefox, and development tools within days of their official release. Plus, with the Copper Build system, you can tap into community-driven packages for everything from audio production to niche programming languages. Performance and Stability How do they perform? Pop! OS is optimized for both Intel and NVIDIA hardware. System76 tunes the curl and graphics drivers for smooth gaming and content creation workflows. Benchmarks show consistently low latency and rapid wake-from-sleep times. Fedora prioritizes cutting-edge kernels and Mesa drivers, which can unlock new hardware features sooner. You'll benefit from the latest scheduler improvements and Wayland optimizations, but be aware that very new hardware sometimes requires manual configuration out of the box. Conclusion and Recommendations To wrap up, if you want a polished, turnkey experience with workflow-boosting features and long-term support, Pop! OS is a fantastic choice. But if you crave the absolute latest software, the pristine GNOME environment, and a deep commitment to open source principles, Fedora Workstation shines. Which distro will you install first? Drop a comment below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more Linux deep dives.